I'm Kat Wilson, I'm an artist, not a photographer, I'm an artist. I'm pretty obsessed with making art. I wanted to be a painter and I accidentally fell in love with photography. And it all started, my grandma loaned me a really fancy camera. I started taking photos. I'll go to art school to be a painter. I have my first photo class, I couldn't wait. I just, it was love, I fell in love. So while I'm in art school, I befriend one of the sculpture professors and he's like, you know, Kat, photography's not really considered art. You know that, right? And I'm like, what? I've never heard that. But it stuck with me. When I graduated and you start thinking about your career and what you're gonna do, I thought, I'm gonna make photography so no artist will ever say again that photography is not considered art. I wanted to have iconography in my photography. And then I started thinking about composition. So I started thinking about this idea of what if I started taking photos of people in their homes with all their stuff around them and then that tells the story of who these people are. And then I'll light it like Caravaggio lights his paintings. So I have all these elements that make up something that was painterly. Used to people made art for other artists or for the high fluting people, right? There used to be a big rumor that Woody Guthrie was my great grandpa, and I really held on to that. I was like, I'm gonna make art for the common man, for everybody. You understand that people's stuff defines who they are or who they want you to see them as. And so for me, in the beginning, it was all about making art for everyone. And so that's why it was so important just to get the people that surrounded me. You know, there's hobbyist artists, there's blue collar artists, and there's white collar artists. We get into white collar artists and uh, we think about meaning all the time. So if somebody were to just take a photo and it didn't mean anything, it was just a good composition. To me, I'm s different than that because I don't just take a photo. Everything has a meaning in it so that you read into it. So it's just trying to think outside of this flatness, right? We're just thinking deeper. It's just about intention. If I have an art studio, I want people to pop in. I want them to look around at my art, talk about it. And so being centralized like this and having other art neighbors and like-minded folks, audience is key for me. We teach other artists in our area to be more professional in a way, like make sure the resumes look good, their website looks good, uh, to value themselves. I will say, everybody needs to start scooping up all the locally famous artists because it's about to be a burgeoning art scene, like we're on the cusp. We're about to have the art school, we have Crystal Bridges, we have support. You better start buying your Sam Kings, your Kevin Arnold's, your Cat Wilson's, all the bigger names in town. Good vibe, just put it in the universe and maybe it'll happen.